Hi, I'm Ovid Olsen, and Cameron, we back to the channel with another one. Today, we're here to react to the GOAT, I mean Drake, talking about the real superstars. I thought he was talking about himself and Kanye son when I was like, when I was reading, and I kept reading the whole caption. Drake gets asked what's his favorite porn preference during an interview, and this was his response. Also, I tried to find this complete interview, and little to my surprise, I'm not sure if that's true and it just hasn't came out, but I saw something online that said all this tiny desk, all this stuff was cap. It was just like roll up. It was like a big ass troll prank. Let's see what Drake got to say about this one. He's somebody that I'm going to take his expertise in this category. You said you're open about porn. What type of porn are you watching? What, what is your thing? It's top. Wow. Holy shit. Highest tier of <laughs> top givers. That's really what I'm. I see. <laughs> and Drake just watching the sloppy toppies. My guy Drizzy, he over here watching other people singing on mics. He's watching Superheads. He's watching that guacky guac guac. Consistently, like on a daily basis, tuned into like. Right. Just really like those are like the real superstars of the world. To me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Drake got a uh, beat off addiction too. Love. I mean, could you Keyword ever two. commit to one woman? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be married. You could be married. Oh, I want to hear his answer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure I could. You know, like I think, uh, I think that, I think that eventually, once all this is said and done for us, and right. that addiction of work and success and forward movement is over, I feel like we're all gonna need something real. Hopefully, yeah. it's not too late. Okay. But then, like right now, I feel like I get into this habit of dating like four or five women to make one woman. Yeah. I like like these like two things Pieces about this girl, one. and then I like like what this girl does for a living, and then I like. Uh, you know what's crazy? You know what's crazy? Once again, I don't know if you guys are my last. That European way of thinking messed up my life. Cause as a kid, I used to always think that like, am I crazy for that? I used to like sign from this drone. I used to like the smiles from this drone. I used to like the way that this drone used to chill and roll up with me. I thought I was crazy. I'm like, yo, I was just, I thought I was tripping. It looks like I wasn't, but y'all manipulate a man. Feel crazy, think bad about himself. Just cause he looks good. Cause if I was, it, cause if I, if I was a nigga with no options in life, they'd be like, man, just be happy that you even got a drone. Why are you talking like this? <laughs> This is me on some bummy shit. I didn't even get a haircut this weekend. I'm still taking your bitch. So it's it, it's just real. I, I I I honestly I don't know if I'll like I, I hopefully I'll find somebody. Biggest thing is I need to be inspired. So I just don't ever I don't know where when like I don't know how to find that with the like with the porn question in there with the other like I just need all those things. <laughs> yeah, you need gumbo. <laughs> the gumbo. Yeah. <laughs> You yeah, I still beat up on a daily basis. What can we complain about? Let's just, the main thing I've learned about this life thing so far is just be happy. Whatever makes you happy. If you like to live this, do that. Don't let nobody pressure you to get into anything. Do what makes you happy. But with that being said, my Dr. Phil time is over. Subscribe to the channel, like the video, 4,000 subs, we will be doing a giveaway. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. And like I love to say, until the next one, we out of here.